Hi, I'm Erin Henley, professional makeup artist, and today I'm going to show you the MAC Face Powder Color Guide. And these are loose powders. So, essentially, we have our whitest end of the spectrum and our darkest end of the spectrum. Now, there are powders that go in between these two, but these are just to give you great examples. When we have MAC, or any other brand for that matter, we have to consider two things. The undertones and just the shades in general. Shades are kind of what I already described, basically just the lightest, which are going to be your more porcelain colors, and then our darkest, which are going to be more of our cocoa colors. Once we've dictated that, whoever our client is, we're going to dictate their skin tone. So she is warm undertones. You can see the yellow peering through. You can see that she's easy to just give a nice yellow color to, and she's really going to liven up. They're going to have the reds and the yellows. Now the blues are going to be better for the pinks, and probably a little bit, a little bit of reds too. So the undertones are very important when considering this. So we're going to go in with a little bit of powder for her. just with some warmth. And these are setting powders that are tinted, or you can get just basic loose powders that don't set, but are just basic foundation. It's up to you. And as we can see, we're really just going in, setting that with the loose powder, but giving it some warmth to the skin as well. Staying within the same color range. Loose powder is kind of difficult to work with, so just use a brush and you'll be fine. I'm Erin Henley, and I just let you know what the MAC Face Powder Color Guide is.